Stop struggling when you look ridiculous. Today I'm going to be doing the sweater weather tag, which I was tagged to do last year by Ingrid. Thought today was the perfect day to do it because I feel a little bit like Tinkerbell. My little green sweater and my little bun that's messy. It's like a sock bun that's not made out of sock. It's kind of weird. I tried to pull pieces around my ears and they're like really long. So I just, I put them back up. I pinned them up because I was like, no. <laughs> My favorite fall candle scent for several years was Bath & Body Works Leaves, and I'm sure you guys know that from my past videos. I was obsessed, and then I went a little bit crazy, and I bought like eight of them. I just got tired of it. I burned them for so long. So then starting last year, I think, or the year before, um, Pumpkin Caramel Latte Candle from Bath & Body Works became my favorite, and that to this day is my favorite candle scent, but I couldn't find it this year in my Bath & Body Works, although I've heard that they have it, so I'm gonna go try to find it somewhere else. But I ended up getting Warm Caramel Cider, and this one is my current favorite. I am a coffee fanatic. I have to say coffee, even though I also like tea and hot chocolate both. I like all three. I'm just a hot drink kind of girl. My favorite coffees at the moment, I probably do want to invest in like an espresso or something fancier, maybe for Christmas. You guys tell me which one's the good one, because I don't know, but I do love my Keurig. So German chocolate cake, which I buy at Bed Bath & Beyond, weirdly enough, who would have thought? The Starbucks breakfast blend is the other one that I really like. These are the two that I drink the most. When I was growing up, my mom would always whip out her pumpkin bread recipe around the fall and she'd make it for me for school every morning and she would sit with me while I had pumpkin bread every morning because I was obsessed with it and I still am. And she would just talk to me in the mornings before going to school. And also where they live in Tennessee, the falls are really beautiful and the leaves are gorgeous. It's kind of mountainy and it's just, I just love the fall so much. And also I have kind of a funny memory. I don't know if I've talked about this in like one of the Halloween tags I've done in years past, but when I was really young, I think it was the very first year my parents ever took me trick-or-treating. I must've been like three or four, Blair wasn't even born yet. I was dressed as a pink elephant, which is where Booga came from. My dad took me trick-or-treating and the house next door had a bunch of like rambunctious teenage boys living in it and they had spooked out their house. Probably actually wasn't that scary to an adult, but to a three-year-old pink elephant, it was terrifying. And one of the boys hid in the bushes and jumped out at me as I was like walking up to like get my candy. And I just had a panic attack. My parents had to take me home and lock the doors because I would not calm down. And to this day, I'm still scared of like, boys hiding in bushes during trick-or-treating. I mean, I don't trick-or-treat anymore, but like even when I was older trick-or-treating, it was always kind of this thing. I am a fan of both, but if I had to pick one, I would say dark lips for the fall. I live in them. I wear them almost every day for the fall and winter. And the combination I'm wearing right now, if you're wondering, is Chanel Rosewood Liner with the Revlon Color Burst Matte Balm in the color Sultry on top. And I also really like the Chanel lipstick in caricature with this liner. That's like my all time favorite combination, but I've been wearing this because this has a minty scent to it. And I just love that. I think it's really refreshing. I'm just going to talk about my favorite fragrance personally, which is the Elizabeth and James Nirvana black perfume. This is what I've been wearing since the summer. I love it. And it is a beautiful fall fragrance because it is a little bit warmer. It has sandalwood and vanilla and some other thing. It's just, it's amazing. I love this scent so much. I'm gonna put some on right now. I don't think I have any on right now. Every time I like spray something when there's a candle behind me, I can just imagine the candle like bursting into like big flames if something flammable goes near. And I always get really scared and I kind of like get scared. I love everything about Thanksgiving food. It is something I look forward to literally all year, but my very, very favorite thing, you guys probably know this, is green bean casserole. I do not know why, but it is always the thing that I look forward to the most. I actually did a Vlogsgiving video two years ago on my second channel. If you guys would like to go watch a day in the Fowler Thanksgiving life, I will link it below. I don't even like leftovers. I'm not a leftovers girl, except Thanksgiving and Chinese food. Considering I live in LA, it's not autumn 
ish the weather it doesn't look like fall it doesn't feel like fall or winter ever now i do miss the seasons because i was raised in the south and so i'm not from here i've lived here for four years so i feel like a local but i'm not really i'm actually a southerner and i do miss having seasons so i do love going home in these months and like experiencing tennessee because it's beautiful there and tennessee is like the quintessential seasons it's just beautiful oh, i love it so much this one from express it has stars on it and i got this last year and i wore it a couple times in vlogmas it's long and so you can wear it with leggings and it's acceptable because it covers your butt and it's just very like snuggly the one i'm gonna say is one that everyone knows it's the one i'm wearing it's lincoln park after dark by opi it is a very 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 dark purple that looks almost black but it does have kind of a purple tone to it and i love this my other one is a berry red my favorite is opi got the blues for red and i also recently picked up the mac nagalak color this is the new limited edition one from the heirloom mix collection which is part of their holiday line and this is just a beautiful like cream berry color that I wanted to try. I would have to say football games because in high school and in college a little bit, although my college team was not any good, we had a better ice hockey team, but in high school I did not miss a single high school football game. I wear them both, I like them both. If I had to pick, I would say leggings because they're so comfortable. Every year before this, if I had filmed this video, any other year of my life, I would have said Uggs. This year, for some reason, I'm gonna say combat boots because I have been loving the more combat-y boots. Um, I'm getting text. Look, I just love it, and I think I'm gonna ask for one for Christmas, but I don't know what pair to ask for. I, I'm like torn, there's a couple I like. If you guys have a pair and you love it, ah, um, write me a comment below because I want a pair, I just don't know what pair I want struggles right hashtag struggle bus i would say yes because it's hyped for a reason i feel like just like any flavor there's gonna be people that like it and people that don't and people that love it and people that don't even care but i think that it's it's festive and i love festive things and i love spicy things when it's a little bit colder out and so pumpkin spice yes yes please i will take one right now please and thank you Stop right there. Thank you very much. I need somebody with a human touch. Um, Spice Girls reference. American Horror Story. Can we please talk about this? I am obsessed with this show every fall. So I would say that's my number one. Also Vampire Diaries. I just, ugh, I love that that's on right now. I know that Grimm and The 100 recently started or they're about to start up. So both of those I'm really excited about restarting too because I really liked the previous seasons. <laughs> I don't really have a song that is specific to fall spirit, but I have a movie and you guys probably know what this is before I even show. This movie and Casper, but especially this movie, totally gets me into the fall spirit and I have to watch it every single year right at the beginning of October. I've probably already watched this four times this year. <laughs> what have I been, I have though. What have I been doing with my life? Um, but I just love it. I love it, it makes me happy, it gives me like, feel good vibes and it never gets old. It's like one of those movies. It's like the Santa Claus or National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation during December. This is my that for October. That was everything for the sweater weather tag. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I would love to see you guys do this video if you haven't already done it. And if you want to do it and tweet it to me, I will watch it because I just, love watching fall things and I'd be very curious to watch it. So tweet it to me and um, yeah, I will see you guys with my next video. Bye.